one-on-one with Lisa Marie Presley. Would she bring Elvis back in a hologram? Would you ever want to do a duet with him in that way? Then... Now, from Hollywood, the insider is on. Lisa Marie Presley is back. My sit down with her. She's candid about Elvis, her music, and her life with twin toddlers. Welcome to the insider. I'm Brooke Anderson. My one on one with Lisa Marie Presley on Elvis, motherhood, and what made her leave Hollywood and music behind. Well deserved award there for Robin. Yeah. All right, straight ahead. Is there a chance that Elvis could come back as a hologram? What Lisa Marie Presley, who has a new album, just told me. Lisa Marie Presley is back with a new album and also a new lease on life. Yeah. It really is hard to believe that she is now 44 mm-hmm. years old. As a matter of fact, Lisa reportedly said that she thought there was a Presley curse and that she wouldn't make it past the age of 42, the age that her famous father died. Well, Elvis's daughter is doing just fine. Better than fine. Tonight, I'm going one-on-one with Lisa Marie to talk about her brand new album, her twin toddlers, and whether she'd ever use a hologram like the Tupac Coachella image to bring her famous father back. Would you ever want to see your dad in a hologram on stage, maybe in concert with you? I just think that things are tasteful, that's good. Um, if not, then, then no. I personally couldn't do it, though. But Lisa Marie Presley did do a video duet with Elvis in 2007. Have you found it challenging to set yourself apart considering your dad is Elvis Presley? Of course, without a doubt. I had a little bit of the trying really hard not to sound like him, not disrespectfully, but just like, ah, it's scary and intimidating. What do you but think he would say about where you are today? What do you hope he would think? Well, I would hope that he would be very proud of me, of course. Lisa Marie is back after seven years with a new album, Storm and Grace, which drops May 15th. The album, a result of escaping life as she knew it, moving to a village in England to start over. We literally just got on a plane and left, sold everything and left the country. (laughs) And I just at some point looked at my husband like, we don't know anybody. And we're moving to the middle of nowhere. And we are literally starting ground zero, having no idea. What was weighing you down? It was not a good situation. It was a lot of them, a lot of people I trusted, a lot of friends, a lot of people that ended up being um, sort of criminals and, you know, vampires and you name it. And when I was kind of living in a wasp nest, I suppose. Um, And then I I got rid of it all. And then, you know, and then I had the babies. And it's just like rediscovering my life. The babies are three and a half year old twins, Harper and Finley. And how did you pull it back together after after twins? At 40, yeah, I know. It was really, that was tough. I, you know, had the babies and had hormone issues. And then you get on hormones and then you get, I don't know, puffed up from hormones. And I don't know, it's just, then getting that sorted out was really good. How do you balance it all? Yesterday was the first time they actually saw me and their father are playing music. I don't like them to see that sort of that side yet. And then I went up and sang and they were a little like, whoa, okay, what are you doing? <laughs> and, then, and then by the end of it, of course, they were playing the tambourine and beating on the, the toms over there and telling everyone, telling me it was too loud. They were bossing everybody around. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Lisa Marie and I bonded over our toddler daughters. It's good girls. to see that there are other old folks out there with toddlers. Are you calling old around here? Me. Good. Okay, not, not good. Lisa Marie. Clear that up. All right. Well, her other <laughs> daughter, 22-year-old Riley Keough, is a model, and Lisa Marie told me she's got five films coming out in the next year. She's proud of all of her kids. Got four total. How's the album? It's great. It's raw. It's soulful. She worked with T-Bone Burnett. Um, I really liked it. 